Hello my love, welcome back to my channel. This week I'm doing a little side project that's fun, pretty easy to put together and I'm sure all of you will have the goodies to put a kit like this together. So I've been in the process of making backgrounds for a larger journal but the majority of sheets that I've been using have been a bit too big for the size of my journal so I've been cutting them and I decided to make some mini journals out of it. The leftover pieces of paper that I made these mini journals out of was about 4 inches in width so I cut them to 2 inches so that when I folded them I would have a little square journal and I just temporarily tied them with some string and I thought because they were small and easy to create in and easy to travel with I would make a little pouch kit because at this point in my studio I have so many bags and pouches and containers from beauty products, skincare products and jewellery that I decided to make one over. Now even if you don't have a stash of makeup bags and drawstring bags I'm sure you have something somewhere that you can adapt. Or I know pouches are fairly easy to make if you're nifty with a sewing machine or you know somebody who is nifty with a sewing machine but if not I suggest rummaging through your cupboards and your drawers to find something that something once upon a time came in such as electricals or clothes or something that will be adaptable for a little pouch kit that you can carry around in your bag. Now if you've been with me a long time I have a whole playlist on travel art kits and travel journals and things like that because I love putting together little portable spaces they're basically little art studios that you take with you and often I can make them quite elaborate so this is a really paired back streamlined just a tiny pouch that can fit in my handbag to be honest for what I'm putting in here I could have actually have gone even smaller I didn't need a pouch this big but for future proofing to play around with this pouch in the future I decided to go with this slightly larger one but I'm only putting inside supplies which are tailored to this particular project so that everything is there and ready for me to just whip out of my handbag no matter where I am and do a little arting so I put together lots of collage that are in line with the same colours and theme that I had in mind for the original journal that I am still making and a glue stick to stick down those collage pieces and then I chose mark making tools that are again in the same colourways that will match in with the journals so that nothing won't be used, nothing is wasted or carried around unnecessarily. I do have a water brush to activate a soluble graphite pencil which I have in the kit which you saw me using at the beginning on the backgrounds but my favourite mark making thing to take out and about with me is by far acrylic markers and my main favourites out of all of the markers on the market are by far Posca markers because in my experience they just stay a lot juicier for a lot longer than most other acrylic markers that can often get a hard nib after the paint has been flowing through them for you know however long but the reason why acrylic markers are my favourite thing to take out and about with me is because my favourite medium really is paint but I don't want that mess in my handbag I don't want to have to take paint brushes and a water container and maybe tissues to clean up and acrylic tubes so they are without a doubt one of my favourite travel supplies and I have a whole favourites list of all of my favourite art materials in the description if you want to see it that was it out of my current project that I'm making an art journal I decided to create this little side project kit out of the leftovers from that journal which as I put it together I will create more little mini books to take about with me and as I fill them up and finish enough of them I'll then figure out a more permanent binding way to put all of the little booklets together but yeah it's gonna be fun I'm gonna enjoy using this little kit let me know if you like this if you're gonna make a little kit with some little mini journals that are super easy to make even out of any scraps that you've got lying around and perfect for handbags if you like this idea give me a thumbs up let me know in the comments if you're gonna make one or if you want to see me actually creating in it when I'm out and about, I may do a little compilation. If you guys are interested enough, let me know. That's up to you. And if you want to see my most recent posted project, it is a time capsule art journal page, which we will be opening in three years time. <laughs> and you can find that on the monthly challenge group or in the monthly challenge group, I should say, on my art community journal workshops. 
and as well as that the super studio spruce up is going to be happening next month and the group is open to join that now to share your art spaces to let us know what you want to do in your space it's a community event over the four weeks of june and it's free to join should you wish to have a fabulously inspiring studio by the end of it i personally can't wait for it because my space is a mess <laughs> So I hope you come join us over there on journal workshops and I will see you all next week. Take care my lovelies.